360, lift 360. Ball. We would have just rolled for a little bit. But we would have been fine. articulate how the how my head is tracking I need to get a virtual reality capture mechanism perhaps doesn't really capture that at all but being able to look through these corners is insane and then when this shit goes down and I'm like flipping and shit and virtual reality is like oh god <laughs> hold on <laughs> oh man I laughed so hard when I did that flip like right away like yep Right away. Whoop! There he goes off the, off the track. Just flipped it. It doesn't even crack the windshield. Um. But this is a really technical course. It's really tight, and you have such a fast car. Trying to get the tail out a little bit. Missed this one. 100 down over bump. <laughs> I didn't go off the edge though. <laughs> Tip right around 360. Somehow killed it in second gear. 60 down, tap in left. Downshift a little earlier there, but not early enough to power out of there. And then didn't hold the e-brake long enough to really turn the car. Way too late this time. I was really reactive. I wasn't even listening to my coach driver at all. I was like, holy shit, this car's fast! <laughs> We're good! We're good, bro! Don't even worry about it. He doesn't even say anything. He's, he's like, whatever. It's our biggest car. <laughs> it's very, really awesome for there to be human there. Be like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. We're cool, man. Crack the windshield. A little distracting, but. Start getting the, I get the hang of the car. Still a hard course. Listening to the call outs. Right six. See if I break early for this. But I would have, but holy crap. We're good. It takes forever to bounce it. Controller, but we're good. Don't hit that, dude. Get off. Where the hell did the track go? Like, I couldn't even see over the steering wheel. Like, where the hell are we going here? Give me a bigger sign, please. People need to not stand right the fuck there, too. Oh my god. Stay away if Will is going down the mountain. 
Oh, we get the cliff. There we go. There's the good uh, J turn I wanted. Then hit the car. Oh. Again, taking forever to downshift with this controller. Such tight air We don't have this in America! <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm good. Oh, hit the car again, whatever. We're going for speed. We're going for time here, guys. Oh, I can kind of move the controller to kind of where my head is. Looking in the corner. So this, this is how I would want to like ideally be looking through this. This is how I'm trying to with my VR headset. Australia. You always want to be looking where you're going because you naturally go where you're looking. It's crazy. It's more to do with how your hands hold the steering wheel and how you're pivoting your body. But it's also kind of zen in the sense like you don't have to think about it. You look at your body does it. If you're driving to whatever we're going to, is what it says. Look through your corners. Jesus. <laughs> we're good! Oh, that's pretty banged up. <laughs> the car is still golden. Oh, man. Oh, we're good. We're good. This is a bank. Kind of, kind of hanging up on the side a little bit, but we're good. We're good. <laughs> Where's the track going? Like, okay, we're right here. Okay. Here I was also a little confused. Was it, I thought that sign was stop. Big red sign that said stop. Like, oh, what? And then I read it. I'm like, oh. I'm mad. Anytime it's a T, it's always kind of confusing. You're supposed to be listening. That's the hard part. While you're doing all this. Listening. I wouldn't look that dramatically. It's hard to kind of get where I want to look. Keep right over crest. If you're going over left, you're gonna hit. You're gonna clip that side. Now it's too far to the right, and then lock the brakes up. I don't think I have ABS on. Pretty sure this whole time I'm locking the brakes. Lock. Understeer. I basically understeer to safety and then power out. That's my strategy. But I'm going way too fast to be controlled. I have limited eyesight here. I can't see around this corner. You shouldn't be glitching through that unless you have really confident calls and you double track before. There's gonna be a person around that corner. Like all of these corners too, I go off the track. I don't hit anybody. I don't think I hit anybody this whole time. I need a little, a little thumb pad and a trigger for the brakes and the gas. The bumpers are shifting the gears. It's pretty legit. I get pretty decent frames with my uh, six-year-old computer, so can't really complain there. This is really just me driving, and having played this game a while. But uh, you know, I technically didn't destroy the car, so can I go back? Can I go to the front? Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Uh, let me get Why is it still pretty decent shape? I mean, there, th this is a rally, so you have many stages afterwards, but for what I just put it through, it finishes pretty decently. I love the Lancey, man. It's a shame it never sold in America. Thank you, Customs. Uh, I think something to do with safety. I don't, I don't actually know why, but you can find them in Canada. Even the car up there. Anyways, thanks for watching. That was Dirt Rally on, uh, was it Greece? I guess, I'm not, I'm gonna try and pronounce this, I apologize, Cthud Leontio? Um, 
I don't know what uh, what a good time is yet. So current best time, I'm uh, I'm a whole minute off of that, but that's not terrible for a <laughs> track I went off several times. And yeah, so that was a lot of fun. Let's do it again. Sometime. 